All right, I believe this is part two of chapter one, module um, nine of the NEAT series. All right, bandwidth. Um, the circuit of the mayor is low on low. The gain in the circuit of the resonance is relatively small. The circuit does not discriminate sharply, reject the unwanted frequencies between the resonant frequency and the frequency on the other on either side of the resonance as shown by the curve that's shown in figure 112 UA. The range of frequencies include between the two frequencies 426.4 kilohertz and 483.6 kilohertz is, is the example at which the current drops 70 percent of the maximum value of the residency is called the bandwidth of the circuit so when it drops 70 percent of the um the um frequency you get your bandwidth of 57.2 kilohertz or um your um resonant frequency of 455 kilohertz um It's seventy percent for radio frequency. Um, bandwidth high and low merit series circuit low merit current curve. All right, bandwidth high low merit series circuit high merit current curve. Re um, resonant frequency in the middle four hundred fifty five kilohertz. Bandwidth ten kilohertz. Um, seventy percent of frequency one and frequency two. Often necessary to state the band of the frequency of the circuit will pass. The following standard has been set with the limiting frequencies are those on either side of the residency at which the curve falls to the point of 7.707, approximately 70% of the maximum value. This point is called the half power. Note that figure 112 series resonant circuit has two half power points, one above, one below the resonant frequency. Um, two points are red designated upper frequency cutoff or frequency cut lower frequency cutoff. Um, Uh, or simplify frequency one and frequency two. The range of the frequency between the two points can compromise the bandwidth. View A and view B, figure one thirteen, uh, illustrate the bandwidth low, high merit resonant frequency. The bandwidth are determined using the following formula. Bandwidth is equal to frequent resonancy of the merit, or or bandwidth is equal to frequency one minus frequency two. Um, where BW is equal to the bandwidth of the circuit in the unit of frequency. Frequency resonant frequency is FR. Frequency two is um, the upper cutoff frequency. Frequency one lower cutoff frequency. For example, applying the formula to determine the bandwidth of the curve shown in Figure One Twelve U A, the bandwidth is equal to frequency one minus frequency two. One, frequency two minus frequency one equals to five fifty-seven two point two kilohertz. And the um, if your bandwidth is fifty-seven two point two kilohertz, the merit of the circuit represented by the curve of the Figure One Twelve U B four forty-four point five. What would be the bandwidth? Their bandwidth of uh, 444.5 kilohertz over forty um, forty-four point five. Uh, Merit would be 10 kilohertz and equal if merit equals 7.95 in the low um, merit circuit is shown figure um, a view, figure 12 112 we can check our original calculation of bandwidth all right bandwidth is equal to um, frequency rate of 455 oh, um, kilohertz over this, um, the 7.9 merit uh, which gives us 57.2 kilohertz which was uh, the bandwidth check um the merit circuit can be determined by transposing the formula with the bandwidth um, merit is equal to um the uh frequency over the bandwidth so if you find the circuit given the found explanation frequency um res residency is 450 kilohertz the bandwidth is 572 point kilohertz you put 455 of um the frequency residency over the bandwidth and you get 7.95 uh which would get really check with the uh, merit Alright, filters. Any practical application complex um, circuit with the various combinations of the direct low frequency, audio frequency, radio frequency currents may exist. Um, frequently necessary to have the means of power, um, means for separating these component current, um, currents at the desired point. An electrical device can be accomplished. Separation is called a filter. Filter consists of inductancy, capacitancy, reactance, resistancy used in a singularity or in a combination depending upon the purpose. Um, it may design so that it will separate alternating current from direct current so that it will separate alternating current from of one frequency or bands of frequencies from the other alternating currents in different frequencies to use the resistance itself um, by its by itself and filter circuits does not provide any filtering action because it opposes the flow of any current regardless of the frequency when it what it does is, is connected in a series or parallel inductor capacitor with, with an inductor or capacitor 
is is to the decrease sharpness and selectivity of the filter hence in some particular application resistancy may be used in conjunction with inductive capacity and provide a filter action over wider band frequencies Filtering circuits may be developed and divided into four general types, low-pass, high-pass, band-pass, and band-reject filters. Electron, electronic circuits all often have the current through the different frequency. This reason the source of the produce of the current from the same frequency applied voltage. Each, uh, example, the AC signal input of the audio amplifier can have high-low audio frequencies. To input the and, and a radio frequency amplifier can have the wide range of radio frequency. In such applications where, where the current and different frequencies components is usually necessary for the filter to either accept, reject one frequency or group of frequencies. The electronic filter then can pipe and pass, a fi and pass on the high frequency components to a load to the next circuit known as the high pass filter. Um, a low pass filter can be used to pass low frequency components. Before discussing filter furthers, we review the apply some of the basic um, principles of frequency response characteristics of capacitors of an inductors. Recall the basic formula of capacitive reactants and inductive reactants. Capacitive reactants equal to 1 times 2 times pi times the um, um, frequency times the capacity, and the inductive reactants equal to 2 times pi times frequency times the induction. Assume any of the um, value of the induction and capacitive increase rapidly when the frequency of the inductive capacity decreases. The inductive reaction, um, um, induction rea inductive reactancy increases. And if if we increase the frequency enough, the capacitor adds a short, uh, acts as a short. The inductor acts as an open. Of course, the opposite is true. Decreasing the frequency of the um, frequency causes the inductive capacitive reactance to increase. The inductive reactants to decrease. Here again, we um, we if we make large enough of the change in the induction and the capacitive reactants acts as an open, the inductive reactants acts as a short. Figure one thirteen gives a pictorial representation two basic components that how they respond to low and high frequencies. All right, this shows your capacitor. Um, low frequency um, shows a short, high frequency uh, you know uh, induction, high frequency low, low frequency no short, capacitor high frequency short. If we apply the same principle, the simple um, circuit is such as the one shown in figure 114, the effect of the input signal is sh uh, shown. For example, the view A of the figure with low frequency is blocked by the capacitor, which acts as the open of high frequency, but the capacitor acts as a short. By studying the frequency, it's easy to have the various components would react to different configurations we change the, uh, in, the, in the frequency. All right, this shows the input with the capacitor and um, resistance on the grounded output. Um, low frequency... Um, Without the capacitor, um, high frequency just through the resistor, inductor, and resistor and B without the and low without the induction, um, a short between the induction. Uh, I guess that's what it means. Um, capacitor resistant reduction of the capacitor and um, reduction of the resistor and the capacitor. Induction C would be uh, induction and capacitor. No induction. No no um no induction. Um, capacitor short. Um, capacitor short. No induction. As mentioned before, high pass and low pass um, low pass filters because of the, I mean, on path of the free, um, specific frequencies for a circuit is, uh, which they are designed. They can um, be a great deal of confusion with the, while talking while talking about high pass, low pass discrimination, attuation to frequency cutoff. Unless the terms are clearly understood, since the terms are used widely throughout the electronic text reference, you should have a clear understanding before proceeding further. A high pass filter. Um, high pass filters pass on a majority of high frequencies to the next circuit to reject the actuations of lower frequencies, sometimes called the low, uh, sometimes called low frequency discriminator, or low frequency actuator. A low pass filter, a low pass filter has a, um, passes on a majority of low frequencies to the next circuit and re rejects the actuations of a high frequency, sometimes called the high frequency discriminator, high frequency actu and actuator. Or discriminator, the ability of the filter to distinguish between high and low frequencies to eliminate the reject unwanted frequency actuation. Um, the ability of filter circuit to reduce amplitude of the unwanted frequency below the level of the desired output frequency. Frequency cutoff, a frequency at which the filter circuit changes from point of the rejected unwanted frequencies to the point with the desired frequencies, or the point at which the filter circuit changes the point of passing desired frequencies to a point of rejected undesired frequencies. 
your low pass filter. Low pass filter passes all the currents having um, frequencies below specified frequency, while opposing all the uh, all currents having frequencies above the specified frequency. The action is illustrated with the ideal form of the view A, figure 115, frequency cutoff known as frequency FC, with a current um, from for a decrease of the maximum um, to, to zero. All frequencies above frequency cutoff filter represent the infinite opposition, with no current. With there is no current. However, there is a sharp division between no opposition and full opposition. Is it possible to obtain a practical graph of the um, current as shown view B, um, where the filter gradually builds up the opposition of cutoff frequency as um, frequency is approached? Note that the filter cannot completely block a, um, current above the cutoff frequency. View A shows a low bypass frequency, um, a frequency cutoff at the top, um, your frequency going from left to right, and the current going up, frequency pass, frequency rejected. Um, frequency but B shows a low bypass frequency, the current is um, from the ideal on the, la on, the pa on the low frequency, and moving it from frequency cutoff, it goes into the frequency rejected. All right, view A116 shows the electrical construction of the low pass filter. Um, Low pass filter with the inductor inserted with the series of the one side of the limit line current carrying both limit high, low, and high frequencies. Uh, position of the reactants will be small, low frequencies greater than uh, high frequencies. In order to divert the undesired high frequencies back to the source, the capacitor must add across the line bypass high frequencies around the load as shown view B. All right, shows hot low frequencies output of um, low frequencies A. Um, Components of the simple um, low-pass filter, components of the simple low-pass filter, uh, capacitator, um, low frequencies output. Components of the simple low-pass filters, high low, um, high fr low frequency, uh, high low frequency, high frequencies output, high frequencies, high frequencies across the uh, low-pass filter with the capacitor. Um, Right, the capacity of the capacitor must be uh, such that the reactants will offer opposition rate frequency above the defi definite value with greater opposition frequency below the value the combined with the series of the inductor and bypass capacity is shown view C. Simplest type of uh, type of um, low pass filter is obtained at, the, at this at point P. The higher opposition is offered below frequency by the capacitor than the inductor. Most of the low frequency current passes at, at, over the least opposition. On the other hand, the least amount of opposition is offered high frequency by the capacitor. Most of the high frequency energy returns the source of the, through the capacitor. All right, high pass filter. High pass filter circuits um, pass all all currents through the frequency higher than specified frequency. While opposing the currents with the frequency lo um, lower than the specified frequency, illustrated in Figure One Seventeen, the capacitor uses you the series of the source, uh, source of both high and low frequencies as shown view A, Figure One Eighteen. Will respond differently with the high frequency, low frequency direct currents. Will offer will offer little opposition to um, passage of high frequency currents. Greater opposition to passage of low frequency currents. Current um, complete block direct currents. The value of the capacitor must be shown. Um, um, chosen so that allows the passage of all the currents that are having frequency above the desired value above the, those of the having frequencies below the desired value. Then in order to shunt the undesired low frequency currents back to source, the inductor used and showed in view B, the inductor must have the value that will allow past the currents, um, past currents having frequencies below the frequency cutoff point. The rejecting currents having frequency above frequency cutoff point, the forcing them to pass the capacitor by combining the induction capacity as shown for UC, the obtaining the simplest type of the high pass filter at P. Most, um, P um, most of the high frequency energy is passed on the load by the capacitor, and most of the low frequency energy is shown back to the source of the, of the through the inductor. All right, so you have your um, current high frequency rejected, um, frequency cutoff on the bottom, frequency passed on um, the higher, high frequency through the capacitor, high output, um, high output frequencies, uh, A is a component of simple bypass, low frequencies, uh, induction coil goes back, um, output none, um, 118C components the simple high pass, but high low frequencies, low frequency, high low frequencies go through the inductor, low frequencies go through the inductor, high output, output, high frequencies go through the capacitor, output high frequencies. 
All right, resonant circuits as um, f as filters. Resonant circuits can be made um, to serve filters as many similar action individual capacitors and indicators as known. But the series of LC circuits are offered maximum opposition to currents that have frequencies and near resonant frequencies, maximum opposition current of all the other frequencies. You also know that the parallel LC circuits offer very high impedance to, current, to the current that have the frequencies near the resonant frequency, relatively low impedance currents to all other frequencies. If you use the two basic um, concepts, the band pass and band reject filters can be constructed. The band pass filter, band reject Rejected filters are common type of filters that use resonant circuits. Or your bandpass filter. A bandpass filter passes a narrow band of frequencies that are circuit error att 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 attenuates all other frequencies are higher or lower than desired frequency. Those shown in Figure 119 with the greatest current existing in the um, center frequency. Uh, and frequencies below res resonance one, Figure 1 and frequencies above resonance Frequency 2, two drop off rapidly and rejected. Figure 118 shows the bad band, band pass filter re response curve. Um, your frequency rejected before frequency lower limit and frequency pass. Um, bad pass um, center frequency, um, frequency upper limit, frequency rejected. And, cir and circuit number figure 120 view A, the um, LC circuit is replaced with the inductor with the figure 116 view A. It acts as the band pass filter. It passes the current through um, having the uh, Frequencies at near the resonant frequencies opposing pa passage of all currents having the frequency outside of the band. Resonant frequencies go through the inductor and output of the frequent resonant frequency capacitator. Um, and this circuit, and the error is A, just a common line. Um, the circuit of the figure 120 view B, the um, induction capacitor circuit replaced with the capacitor figure 116 view B. Um, the circuit is tuned with the same frequency as the LC circuit. It will provide a path of all the currents having the frequency outside the limit of the frequency band pass by a series resonant circuit. The simple type of the band pass is formally connected with the two LC circuits as shown in Vigor 120 view and C. The upper, lower, and frequencies limit um, the filter action of the fil filter cutoff points. So non-resonant frequencies go through the inductor capacitor and back um, output is none. And um, when there's non-resonant frequencies... Figure 120 shows the rejected frequencies going through the capacitator in the um, in the inductor. All the other frequencies going through the inductor capacitor band desired frequencies outside desired frequencies. So one's one set to tune in between the resonant frequencies. This one is um, keeps that reverts the jack, um, um, bad frequencies. All right, band reject filter. Um, band reject um, circuit is used to block the passage over the current narrow band frequencies will align the current to flow with the frequencies above and below the pan, um, this band. This type of the filter is also known as band suppression, band stop filter. This way, response is shown with the response curve of the figure 121. So, um, since the purpose of the band rejector filter is directly opposite of the band pass filter, the relatively position of resonant circuits are filtered or interchanged with the parallel LC circuit is shown in figure 122 view A, replaces the capacitor with figure 118 view A, exits the band reject filter, blocking the passage of the current through the high frequencies near resonant frequencies, passing all currents having the frequencies outside the band. The series of the um, inductor capacitor circuit is shown in figure 122 view B, replaces the inductor figure 118 view B. Um, if the series circuit is tuned in the same frequency of the parallel circuit, it can access the bypass of the van re rejected frequency. The simplest type of the van rejected filter is obtained connecting two circuits as shown in figure 122 view C. All right, 121 shows the band rejected filter response curve. Um, the fr frequency rejectors are on the outside from frequency lower limit and um, frequency upper limit. Um, center frequency, frequency rejected. Um, All right, your resonant frequency is com um, and output is none. Um, show the induction coil and the capacitor sign. Same thing as the band pass, um, but it's a band back man rejected filter. The resonant frequencies go through the inductor capacitor. None go out through the band rejector. Um, high low frequencies, all frequencies, band rejected frequencies go through the passer and band, the induction capacitor um, circuit um, parallel circuit. Desired frequency output. Desired frequencies. All day. Okay. Multi-section filters. Um, all various types of filters we have discussed so far have only had had only one section. In many cases, they use the simple form of the circuit that do not provide sufficient sharp cutoff points. But uh, adding capacitor, inductor, resonant circuit, and series or parallel, depending upon the type of the filter action required, the ideal effect of it is more approach, more nearly approach. There's such additional units added to the filter circuits forming the resonant circuit resembling letter T or Greek letter pi. They are therefore called the um, T or pi t, t or pi type filters. To Depending on the symbol that they resemble, two more T's or Pi type filters may be connected to the produces sharper cutoff current um, cutoff point. 
Figure 123 view A, view B, view C. Figure 124 view A, view B, and view C. Depict some of the common configuration of the T, of the T type, pi type filters. Further discussion above theory of the, oper, of the operation is going to be on the inter, intended scope of the module. If, if you are interested in learning more about filters, a good source of information is the Electronic Insulation Maintenance Handbook, Section 4 Electronic Circuits, Navy C 0967LP0000120. Our source load capacitor in the middle um, form of t uh, type um, filter. You're forming a t type filter, filter induction one, induction two. Um, once again, the, forming a t type filter L3. Um, forming a pi type filter um, capacitor um, in between the um, capacitor, capacitors in between the, um, you know, in between the inductors. And then again, safety precautions. When working with the resonant um, circuit of the electronic, electrical circuits, you must be aware of the potential high voltage. Look at the figure 125 with the series resistant total impedance circuit of 5 ohms. Um, your total inductancy over the um, minus that is on zero. Um, your voltage is 10 volts at 60 hertz. Remember that impedance is equal to the amps is equal to the um, 10 volts over the impedance, which would be 5 volts, um, 20, 20, 20, 20, 50, 50, 60 megahertz, uh, uh, or 10 volts over 5 ohms, um, 2 amps, the voltage drop around the 2 amps current flow, the, um, voltage, um, uh, the voltage capacitation of the amperage, um, total over the time of the voltage capacitancy. Is two times twenty forty volts AC um, or voltage inductancy amperage total times the volt in, induction reactancy or um, tw two times twenty forty volts. Um, so you'd have voltage resistance or equals volt voltage uh, amps total times resistance or two times five would give you ten volts AC. You can see that there is a voltage gain across the reactive components of the rea re resonance and frequency such as the inductive reactants and inductive capacities were equal to 100,000 ohms of the re resonant frequency. The reactants from um, voltage across the inductive capacity would increase 2,000 volts AC with 10 volts AC applied. Be aware that potential high voltage can exist in series resonant circuits. Summary, Chapter 1.